Today, I have participated in different live broadcasts online with Chinese tea friends starting from this morning till the afternoon. So, and all of a sudden, I thought about an old friend. Bao Zhong from Nangang from Taipei, which I haven't drank since I took it back in 2013. It was a prize winning quality made by an old farmer. Mr. Chen, together with his wife. At that time, Mr. Chen was already over 60 years old, and he was worried because his children do not want to continue the tea business and tea production. As you can see, this tea was made on the 16 or 18 May 2013. For each competition tea, there's a seal label, and this is the tea today when I open the bag. It still looks very sharp and very sexy, isn't it? Strong, but in the meantime, gentle on the other hand. The aroma from the dry leaf is very sweet, woody, grassy, it's a very complex aroma. And the color it looks like honey with some greenish touch inside. I still remember the reason why I put it away because at that time, the taste was a little bit too greenish for me, too much in inside. So I put it aside. Guess what? I forgot it completely until today. And now I'm going to compare the color with the other Fenghuang Danchong I drank today which on the left is the Danchong, which on the sixth brewing, on the right is Baozong from the first brewing. You can see the color is very, very different. The color from the Baozong is almost like honey with some greenish inside. It looks very rich. At first I said, uh oh, I don't know how is the taste. When I drink it, I was amazed by its gentle sweetness and the softest, smooth taste.